What is up, bokeh loving oh. brothers and sisters? This is a show all about discussing and discoursing the latest products in the world of photography. And with that out of the way, let's not diddle daddle any further and get kick started with the show. Boom! Hey, hang on. I like your sweatshirt. Oh, oh yes, it's that. nice, isn't it? Where did oh. I get this? Where did I get this lock? Oh, oh. I, I hope I won one too. I so won one. I, I only got some stickers, which is not, not bad as well. Look at that. I yeah. put on my uh, batteries and put on my pelican case. Mm. Oh, that it is. There's no one there. Oh, it's Fuji Fuji. Well, I tell you what, Locke, now is your lucky day because you can get this stuff on our oh. Teespring store. Oh, it's just down there. That's convenient. It's in the description box. There it is. Oh, yeah, you can click it. Yeah. Collect them all. Yeah, like Pokemon. Somebody asked for it in the, the comments in the last video. It, you know, yeah. we should do merch. Here it is. And then we yeah. agree. And then we quickly done it. So quick. Yep. So we're sponsoring our own show today. This, this show is sponsored yeah. by our merch store. These by you. You know, this is designed by Locke. These graphics, you know, the bo Super Boca Bros, um, or the Boca Bros graphics, whatever you want to call it, was yeah. designed by the man right there. So, you know, give, exactly. give a clap. But the, so the many best times way, I, keep, I keep mentioning I was the designer, and this is yeah, uh, proof. To, don't just give me a clap. The best way to, to, you know, do that is to just buy the merch. Yeah. Anyway, let's get started with the show before people stop watching and this will be like yeah. a, the lowest audience retention ever. We're talking about not just a latest product, we're talking about a product that doesn't even exist at the minute. We're getting like Tony Northrup. Totally random. Do you think he, when he gets a bit older, he's going to look like the Colonel, the KFC Colonel? <laughs> Anyway, we are talking about something which is close to our hearts because we're Sony lovers, I'd say. I wouldn't say fanboys. Quite we literally, like it's close to my heart. <laughs> right here. <laughs> yeah, boom, there we are. Sony, Sony. We use Sony for to take video, take some photos as well. But this has been a long time coming. We've been waiting for the A7S III for a long exactly. time. Everybody has. The whole world. And because there are no rumors, we are going to come up some rumors. We're going to create <laughs> the dream A7S III and we hope yeah. and we think that this is something that they need to do to make the A7S relevant again. I mean, there, there are some obvious things that they should do. I mean, there's obvious things like they're going to put the same autofocusing system that they put in every other product they put in like in the 2019. Real-time tracking. It, it's really good. It's really good though. I love that real-time tracking. Color science, that's another Color obvious Color science, because, new kind of science from uh, newer Sony. Um, maybe not so obvious, but Z-type battery, I guess it is kind of obvious because all the other A A7s yeah. have got Z battery. This is ridiculously small. Sorry, what is? The I, battery. I don't see what you... Oh, okay. <laughs> the battery is ridiculously small. It's the same battery from uh, yeah. NEX era, 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 era. It's era. true, it's, it's true what you said in episode eight. But you won't be excited about Small? I don't know. Some what? people might like small things. Is it true with batteries? Exactly. Small batteries, not good, especially when you're shooting full frame, 4K video. We need a Z battery, an A7S III. Flaps? I think the flaps, may, maybe that's not too obvious, but the flaps have got to change. <laughs> yeah, only, only the until you mention it. And only until you mention it, I realized, oh yeah, actually, I, I, thought, I thought all cameras have this kind of like flappy, flat bend but yeah they are like you can't bend it because yeah. most other most other cameras they have their flap that you can bend it so but yeah. this one see it just These... stick out but yours it, is look. a little bit better but yours is a little marginally bit better, because better. This, yeah because you can flip it around not this yeah. one it just stick out <laughs> i don't know whether that's just just me and you um what do you guys think do you hate sony flaps are f sony <laughs> flaps crap i think they are only crap, crap flaps, TM. <laughs> yeah, that'll be the new thing, like from <laughs> black magic to true white, true black, or something like that. Crap magic. flaps, TM. Did they have black magic? Dark magic? Mm. I think it might be white, white magic. It's just sounding really dodgy. Yeah, something. <laughs> it sounds like it's talking about jizz or something. Um, <laughs> overheating. I, I, no, I, I'm not. What, what are you think? The magic, the magic has come. Overheating. 
<laughs> overeating. I'm not eating. Yeah, not, no, not overeating. Yeah. It's not yeah, a overeating. buffet, but I don't think that's that obvious. They, they've had three generations to fix that. Their products still overheat. For some reason, I think that your A7 Mark III actually overheat more than my A7S Mark II. This only overheats under direct sunlight. If it is in the yeah. shade, it can, it can keep going on. It, yeah, like that's... a Duracell bunny. But I think that's the obvious ones that way. Shall we, let's, let's brush that aside and let's get yeah, on to some yeah. more juicy stuff that we may, may or may not happen, but we think must happen for this to be It's just relatively act. a little bit more juicy because this is still in a, we are going to talk All about right. things that it's just catching up with other brands. Yeah, well, obviously they're going to do 4K60. No, well, it's not obviously, but 4K60, uh, Panasonic I S1. I think it's quite obviously. Everyone do 4K60 now. Yeah, but I mean, Sony has had, they're, they're on the third generation of now, and, and it's still essentially more or less the same, 4K, 25, 30, the 100 Mbps. So will yeah. they bother? Will, will they, they bother with 4K60? They, they should, they should. Let everyone doing They've 4K60. Got to. They have to. Yeah, um, they've got to, that's for sure. But FX9, are they going to be <sighs> shitting on their own doorstep with this? Now even Canon don't quite care about that anymore. So Sony shouldn't. Actually, their cinema camera probably their different department anyway. They don't care. That's <laughs> true. It's true that they, they all seem independent from each other. But I I I, I guess yeah. it's going to be four K sixty uh, cropped. When you shoot half speed, when you when you've got a four K fifty and you slow it down. You can make something really boring look interesting. It's 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 like designer putting a drop shadow to something boring. <laughs> we need to drop a shadow on here. That doesn't need. <laughs> eight bit, eight bit don't have drop shadow. Yeah, that's right. Anyway, talking about eight bit, eight bit video. Uh -huh. They've got to increase that to ten bit, right? Yeah, of course, of course they have to. That, that's my point as well because. <laughs> I was trying to. I was trying to coax you into it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was yeah, trying yeah. to push you into it. Well, I mean, I mean, uh, 8-bit was fine back then because this is like 2015 when it can shoot 4K internally. It's like, oh wow, bloody hell. It doesn't matter if it should 8-bit, but now everybody else do 10-bit. If they want to catch up, if Canon are going to put 8K in the i5, i5? I <laughs> <laughs> in the R5? with an R, then they're going to have to catch up, right? That, that's catching up. Does anybody really, really need it? It's going gonna, it's gonna to make nice 4K footage for sure. And you, and you can crop in, the hell out open it. gate. Yeah. Say for example, you're going to get the A7S 3 yeah. 8K. What, are you going to use it? it? It might be troublesome because that probably means that I have to get a new computer or get some new faster hard drive. Because when I added S1 H 6K footage on my iMac with my hard drive is already on its limit. Talking about some obvious things, um, we, we missed one, flip screen. Flip screen complainers, it makes sense for video. Yeah. Let's just leave it there, yeah? But please, if you, uh, Sony, if you do flip screen, just copy the flip screen from the X-T100 or the X-T200. That's the best flip screen when you, yeah. uh, actually, also the X-1H as well cause it do flip up and flip out rather than the usual flips when yeah. you have to flip out and then turn it. Another thing is I hope they have better in body stabilizer yes. which they call a steady shot. Yes. <laughs> Starting from the A7 Mark II, they have in body stabilization that works with the in lens stabilization. That sounds so cool, but then it doesn't work that well when I compare the A6600 to the A6100. One with in-body stabilization, one without in-body stabilization. They look the same to me yeah. in video mode. I think it has a little bit difference on still mode, but not in video mode. I mean, when you, when you name other brands that do good IS, IBIS these days, it's like, take your pick. You've got Panasonic, but then, We've got this. Oh my god, the locks are even holding. Oh, actually, I'm, I was pretending. They do it full frame as well. Yeah. Nikon's full frame IBIS thing. is pretty good. Uh, Not bad. Canon yeah. doesn't have IBIS yet. Yet. 
but the import, um, I mean, the big in lens is already so yeah. good. And then Fuji, okay, it's not full frame, but APS-C, pretty good. It sounds simple. It's probably actually quite complex, but they've... Maybe, but... But do it. <laughs> this is not just about catching up. They've got to make a, make a big splash with this. And for big splash, We've, yeah. got, we've got some ideas and my, idea, my first idea is to have separate sensor and lens mount with the rear control bit, separate. It's like a face off. What? It's like, it's like the Wii called GXR. GX, GXR, yeah, GXR. No, no it, that, it wouldn't be that shit. The Wii called GXR, when you take it apart, it stops working. My idea is that yeah. you have the, it'll still work, it'll, it'll connect. Um, maybe wirelessly or with a wire so you can, I don't know, have it remote shooting so you can have the camera, the sensor and the lens over there and then I can control it here. It sounds nice but the cameras will be much bigger and because you have, the, you have all the components of like, like connect and disconnect and uh, I don't know about where the ceiling as well. Actually it will be a better option to just like the set camera I'm using, if they have a phone app and you can connect it with wire. Yes. Actually, yeah, they, they need to prove their apps. The Z camera app is they, good. Yeah, that, that, that too. It is so good. It is like, it should be like. Sony, just check out Z cam's app. It's pretty good. How about this? Global shutter. I mean, I could just say, okay, they've got to have better yeah, rolling shutter. Yeah, global shutter, good. They've got to have better rolling shutter, but I think Why not just no rolling shutter? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, if you have global shutter, I would suggest why not just do without the mechanical shutter? Mm. I mean, why do you still need the mechanical shutter? There's no rolling shutter and you have more space to put something else. Yeah. Maybe bigger, I mean, a faster CPU, not bigger. Mm. I mean, well, if they've got more space, they can put an internal ND filter, maybe. They've had an RX. I don't know how... Yeah, I don't know how... Well, RX is small. I mean, so poor sensor. This is a full-frame sensor. I don't know how big the ND, the in-body ND actually will yeah. be. Even the electronic ND. I'm not sure how... Well, I don't know. It would be cool. And also, yeah. with, with regards to picture profiles, I think they should have things just like a, a Venice look. Instead of all this like Cine 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, S-Log 2, 3, a movie, stills, IT 709. Well, well, Venice look will be just another Cine look. It just have a branding on it. Yeah, but get rid of all those different ones. You look at uh, Panasonic and it's very simple. You've got Cine like D, Cine like V. With the d different ones on Sony, it gets a bit confusing if you just put a Venice look, boom. It's got a, a, a very catchy name to it. I remember that. I remember mm -hmm. which one I should be using. A Turner. Okay, boom, I'm going to use that. Cine 1, Cine Eternal 2. Great. 1, 2, 3, 4. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, which one? Which one's which? I can't remember. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. I got it. Yeah, it's, it, it don't tell you what is Cine 1, 2, 3, 4. It's too geeky. And it gives a. Yeah, it's give a great opportunity for YouTubers to make a video to talk about oh comparing Cine 1, 2, 3 and 4. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, I think that's <laughs> it. I, I can't think of anything else. Yeah. That's what we think anyway. Th this might be just fantasy land. I, I, maybe it's maybe it's fantasy land. What, what do you think? Do you think this is realistic for the Ace Industry? Are we just taking things too far? Are we just picking things that we'd love to see which are which is basically a cine camera in in a camera that's meant for consumers a hybrid camera meant for consumers what do you think we'd love to hear what you think in the comments below but um in the comment below uh before we go we've got prize giveaway not from us not from us this is but from this is not yolo live yeah this is not paid for they this is not this is not sponsorship so we don't get any money for nope. this but they said they're giving some stuff away and we thought okay we would love to give some stuff away to our lovely super boker bros and sisters. So here it is. What are we giving away? We're giving Lock. Lock's got the stuff. Not not we. They they are they are giving away. Uh, oh, yeah, Yolo Live is this this thing. This is called. Uh, they, this is a Yolo box from Yolo Live that you do. Uh, is for doing live stream. Yeah. And I actually done a review on this. Check out my review over there. Yeah. It is a 
live review of this live streaming box it do multi cam is it is pretty cool and it's got touch screen one winner will get this and uh see you in we build s mm. i don't have it but i just have this one it's a smaller one but you get the big one and you can also get a pair of holy land 400 mass mass 400 mm. s jesus christ it's holy land and then you get the roll video my ntg which is here right. i'm using okay. it so i can't really show you uh you're not listening to you it because it i'm using a uh, wireless but to, hear, oh yeah, yeah i can switch yeah. to that i'm using it for backup but yeah you can get this aperture almc i think they should make a better name for it but it's a led light it's white or you can set the color temperature or you can do rgb color as well look whoa whoa and it works with bluetooth which is pretty cool you can also get a free world f6 plus field monitor i don't have it right here and you can get a small rig camera cage which i really want one as well yeah you just go to the yolo live post we will put a link in the description just go to that link and do whatever they ask you to do but yeah anyway as as we said it's not paid for it's not a sponsor, sponsored message so no. Do what you like. You don't have to do it, obviously. And um, yeah, if you want to win but some do stuff, do it quick because it will end on March the third, third of March, mm. which is just a few days. Somebody, somebody actually, some, somebody made a good point that I haven't um, announced the winners of previous competitions that I did. Uh, I just kind of sent a message to them and said, "Hey, you won. Um, here you go. All right, there we are. Okay. <laughs> what? Yeah. Anyway. Know, anyway." That's it, isn't it? This has been a, a great show. That's it. About the ASIN S3. Check out the links in the description box for this giveaway mm. and for this merch. Don't, don't, keep, don't keep mentioning it. They, they, they haven't paid. But yeah, merch. Merch. <laughs> that. Yeah, enter the... Look, it's so cool. I want that as well. Yeah, I oh. want it. Oh, I've got it. I got it. No. <laughs> there we are. Oh. But yeah, competition, merch. Right. Thanks for watching. See you again. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.